What's up Nakamas? Welcome back to the channel and today we have a pretty awesome video with Avengers Endgame going on uh, throughout this whole weekend. I know a lot of people have seen the movie. No spoilers please, I do want to say that. <laughs> but with that going on, we do have the GameStop exclusive limited edition uh, Thor Glow in the Dark Funko Pop. So it's time to get on board and shukasuru. So GameStop gave me a call, told me that this awesome pop came in for me, so I couldn't wait to go and pick it up. Now this one was one of the pricey ones, I do want to say that. Um, this one was, I think, retailed at about $29, $34.99. I don't, I don't know if I'm right in that, but it's a little bit up there compared to the other ones. I know you can get Tony Stark for $25, bucks, I believe it is, at Target, and uh, the rest of them are probably going to be around $30. So this one's uh, like $5 more expensive than the others. But without further ado, I mean... Doesn't matter too much to me because I really wanted the pop. I want to say this while I show you guys the box. Now it is very shiny. I like the the color that they went with the box. It does show a little bit of glamour, like it's like boom popping at you in a sense. But you see the Avengers logo right there on this side, and on the other side of the box, you see Thor written on it. The box is pretty cool. Now <laughs> I have seen the movie already. I do want to say that, and man, I can't say anything about it. But I do want to mention something probably towards a little bit towards the end of the video um, that I'm excited about, but that's gonna be a little further down. Um, this side of the box kind of shows you a glam shot of the Funko Pop right there, and it shows you the t-shirt that it comes with too. So let's go ahead and open this thing up and see what comes inside of it. So it always comes with a protective plastic, which I mean is always appreciated, of course. It makes your uh, item feel a little bit more like a newer item as well. So mm, smell plastic, I don't, I don't know why I do that. I know a lot of, I do that all the time. I don't know if people do that, <laughs> but okay, let's go ahead and open this up. And all right, cool. So here we have this shirt. I'm going to open this up in just a bit, but let's take out the pop. Oh, and I'm hoping, I, I, I think I saw something. I'm hoping it's mint, but we're going to see. I'm going to save the box. And we are on the clear. Yep. <laughs> okay. It looks good. It looks really good guys and wow okay so I really really love the color of the suit here but let me go ahead and show you guys oh man okay there's a oh I might be able to fix that but here we go that's how the Funko Pop looks right there and of course it has that GameStop exclusive sticker with the glow in the dark sticker along with it as well um, side of the box um, it's pretty much the same Funko um, Avengers Endgame box as all the other ones um, but there you have the other side and the front again. So this is the side I was talking about. It's a little, it's like somebody put their finger in there and kind of crushed the box just a little bit. It's right at the bottom. I don't know if you guys can see it very well right there. Hope you guys can. Um, that kind of sucks though. Ah, oh, I wanted a minty box and I don't know. I might, I might be able to take it back to GameStop, but I don't think they have any more of him. So. Um, I might have to deal with that, but that's okay. I think the most important thing for me here is definitely the Funko Pop. Now, um, I'm gonna go ahead and get him out of the box, and while I'm explaining him in detail, uh, yeah, I am gonna show you guys a glam shot of the Thor Pop as well. Oh, before I forget, let's go ahead and open up this t-shirt. Okay, you guys, so here we have the t-shirt, and it looks good. Um, I'm not a big fan of that color of t-shirt. I kind of prefer maybe like a, sometimes I prefer a brighter color or just straight up a dark color, like a dark gray or even a black. But that doesn't look bad. I love the art that they, did, they decided to go with here on the t-shirt. And this is something that I would wear every day. <laughs> not every day, but I would use for everyday use, right? So um, that's pretty cool. Usually I, most of my pop t-shirts, I use them for either I'm in the house, I'm not doing much or just, you know, for for comfortability if if I can say that right but um but this one I feel like I can use going out and about I, I kind of like these graphic tees that Funko does um I definitely am a fan of this one so you can see that they decided to go with the glow around Thor because this is a glow in the dark pop so enough talk about the t-shirt let's go ahead and take a look at this Thor pop over here okay now without saying too much about Avengers Endgame because <laughs> just Looking at this pop, if you've seen their movie, there is a big spoiler. I cannot say anything. I want to give people a chance. And with saying that, you guys, <laughs> let's be respectful. Down in the comment sections, please. 
let's give this a few days. I know a lot of people still haven't seen the movie, so <laughs> let's go ahead and uh, do that. Be respectful to others who haven't seen the movie. But without further ado, let's just go ahead and talk about this story of Funko Pop. Now, I do want to say, first of all, one of the big things is that usually in the in the, the suit is probably one of the biggest details. Usually where the black goes, you can see that they decided to go with this, like, I, I believe that's the glow-in-the-dark plastic. And I am going to pull up a glam shop right now. It might be right in front of the, the pop when I'm showing it, or it might be on the side. But you can see that they, they decided to go with this light blue plastic. And I believe that does represent the glow. I haven't tested the glow, but you are going to see the photo right now, guys. Um, but it looks pretty cool. I actually prefer this plastic <laughs> over the black plastic that they use for the natural suit, right? So this looks pretty cool. And of course, we have that eye and Thor's silver eye right there. Um, <laughs> that's all I'm going to say. And then we do have him holding Stormbreaker as well, which looks pretty legit. But besides that, it's a pretty simple Funko Pop. And I do want to say, I kind of do want to collect the rest of the glow in the dark um, Avengers as well. So it's most of the major Avengers. I think it's just four of them. We are missing Hawkeye and Black Widow. They didn't decide to, uh, they didn't decide to do a glow in the dark for them. But I do want to get the other ones too. But this is our first one and I'm excited to have them. Now, for those of you that just can't contain it and want to talk about spoilers, hit me up <laughs> on a DM. You can follow me on Instagram. We can talk spoilers all you want on Instagram, okay? And about this Funko Pop too. But besides that, let's be respectful to people for a few days. Now, <laughs> I did want to mention that because I also want to say this. I actually had an idea and I think I might want to try. I don't know yet. I don't know if we're going to do this yet, but I want enough of you guys to give me your feedback on this idea. I think I want to try our first live stream here on the channel. I know <laughs> it's kind of nerve wracking for me, <laughs> but I want to see what you guys think. Hit me down in the comment section. And let me know if a live stream will be a really cool idea. If I do one, it might be probably right before the weekend. So it might be either Wednesday or Thursday, um, Friday. I'm not sure, but probably one of those two days would be a better day for me. But besides that, you guys, that's going to be it for this video. It was a bit of a short one. <laughs> like I mentioned, I wanted to share that idea of the live stream. I definitely want to talk more about Avengers Endgame. And in the live stream, I do want to say, I want to talk spoilers. I want to talk about Endgame. I want to share it with you guys. Of course, I am going to do a fair warning for everybody that if we do get on this live stream, that there is going to be spoilers included for Endgame. And I'll talk about a couple other stuff too. But... <laughs> That's going to be it for us today, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this video and this quick unboxing. Always remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, Nakamas. Bye.